everyone. So Reba and I are chilling here at work. Hey Reba. <laughs> um, so I'm having kind of a plain day with my hair. Reba's gonna spice it up, use some products, and we're gonna go with something a little bit messy dressy. So <laughs> let's get started. Oh, oh, fish face. Fish face. Duck lips. Get it straight. Oh. I already put this in her hair and it's just like a thermal protector. Can you see it? Which one is it? I'm guiding my hand. <laughs> Red Kit. So it's a heat styling product. It's called Duo Shield 07. So I'm gonna put some volume in your hair. So I'm gonna it. Look at that. Oh. Oh, and you're <laughs> done! <laughs> yes. That's awesome! So I'm just back combing the hair right now and I'm just pushing everything to the right. So I said in the other clip that I'm gonna I wasn't I wasn't sure what I'm gonna do but now I can do it. I'm gonna okay. do something, you gotta play on something fun and funky. So I'm pushing everything to the right, like I said. Just smoothing everything out. Okay. I know it looks a little weird, but just, just do it. <laughs> do that again, do that again. Yeah. Slow mo that. <laughs>
Now we're gonna take this first section here. I'm just gonna use the tail comb just to help me get a cleaner liner. And I'm gonna take my big curling iron, I would say it's like an inch and a half. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. I'm gonna make sure we're right on that. And I'm gonna just curl it back. And it doesn't have to be completely curled, I just need a little bit of that kink just to help it stay. So if someone didn't have a big curling iron like that at home, what else would you do? What would I do? Yeah. You can take a normal one inch or smaller um, curling iron and you can just take thicker sections, but not too thick, but thick enough so that the heat can go and penetrate through the hair. And then once you get that texture and that wave, that's good enough. You just need a little bit, a little bit just enough so that you're able to kind of bend the hair back more easily rather than having straight hair trying to make it, you know, curve back. This is, uh, makes it a lot more easier to work this into the hair. Okay, so I'm just gonna take all these pieces and just back combing it. And now I'm gonna push it all forward, smooth it out, and smooth it underneath too. Okay. And then I'm going to use a little bit of texture of sea salt spray. So this is just going to give it... It's going to give it a little bit more grittiness to the hair, just so it will stay longer. So now I'm going to take my two fingers, like scissors, and um... <laughs> Thank you, Jasmine. <laughs>